All right. So before I go into giving myself errors and then fixing them, um, more than likely, if uh, you have a bad icon or pin name after uh, a reinstallation of voice meter or maybe a Windows 10 update, Windows 11, of course, um, it, it could be something bigger. Uh, so there could be a possible like other hidden um, stuff that uh, could cause issues. Um, so it's it's rec it's recommended to reinstall those specific things. So if you get an error on the cable, reinstall the cable. It will more than likely fix it. Um, that of course goes with voice meter. Uh, I have seen it before where you download voice meter, you get an error, you reinstall, still get the same error, and people have reinstalled it like five times and then it fixes it. Um, I think you can fix that by just fixing the icons, then reinstalling it, and then it will work. Uh, but what, yeah, but what I do in this is I give myself errors and then I fix them manually. So I guess that could be like the last resort. Um, but yeah, so fair warning, reinstall stuff first just because it's recommended. If it doesn't work, then you can try what I'm doing here. All right. I'm going to close voice meter and reopen it. Uh, and this is what you guys, if you do get this error, then this is what you would see. There's your error. Um, and I've changed a bunch of my things, so that's why nothing is working good. Um, let's check it out. So the error, I probably made it the worst case scenario. Um, so yeah, so check driver installation. And I have 64 errors. This is probably the most you can have. <laughs> I don't even think I've seen this many before. Um, where do we even start? So all this stuff, don't really look at it. Um, it's not going to really show you anything that you're going to be looking for, for the errors, but you got your VB cable. This is if you have the cables, uh, you got cable, the, the free one. I got bad pin, uh, names cause I renamed them all, uh, bad pin icons. The icons are bad and I can show you that after you got cable A, B, C, D, and then uh, we don't have this installed. We don't have the hi-fi cable installed. Uh, voice meter Veo, uh, one of the drivers with voice meter. That also seems to have incorrect naming and incorrect icons for both sides of it, uh, the input side and the output side. And same goes for Aux and Veo 3. All have bad names, bad icons. Yeah. So quite annoying. Um, it won't really affect how voice meter works for the most part. Um, but it's still something you want to fix at least. Um, so yeah, I will show you, uh, what mine looks like now. So what we do is you come down here, right click sounds. If you're on windows 11, I believe you right click, you go into there, you scroll to the bottom and it'll say open advanced sound properties or something like that. It, it, you can look it up on Google if you really need to, but we're going to go to sounds and we're going to come through here. So these devices all look normal. And then we start reaching the voice meter ones. Um, definitely have, if you know what they're supposed to look like, definitely have the wrong icons, definitely have the wrong names. You can't even tell what these are. I mean, I've renamed these personally, but uh, yeah, definitely something going on here. Follow this exactly, and you should have no issues. Um, I like to start from the middle. So you can definitely tell what the, na the name is still because it says it right here. So we're going to find this one in the playback section. We're going to click it. We're going to go to properties, and we'll start with the names. So this name is voice meter input, and the capitals need to happen. Um, if I press apply apply uh, we got the name so the name is voice meter input and that's on voice meter veil right there let's go see if it actually worked so before we had 64 errors now we have 62 we're getting there 
So 60, <laughs> it took away two errors just with one fix of the name. So let's continue. We'll just do names first. I'm not worried about the icons right now. Um, but so let's do voice meter aux. So this would be voice meter aux input. Let's apply. And that should be good. I'm not going to check it. We're going to check it afterwards. See if I can. Maybe maybe I'll mess up. So we'll see. Um, this one is voice meter veo3 input. Good. So the, vo the voice meter one's done. Let's do some virtual cables. So cables have some interesting naming. Uh, so this is the original virtual cable because it has no letter or anything. The properties. This is cable, all uppercase, I and input, done. This is all in the playback area, so they all, they're all going to say input. Cable D, cable, minus sign, D, input, done. Next one, cable C, so we're going to do cable C, input. Cable B, cable B input pretty easy pretty straightforward cable A input and this is if you have the cables if you don't have the cables eh. um okay so the names are all correct let's just double check this we're down to 48 errors we almost cut it in, almost in half so um let's just keep sticking to the side so we'll do the um We'll do the icons next. Icons a little bit more trickier. Um, finding them for voice meter uh, is a lot harder than finding them for the cables. Uh, so, okay, I had to stop the recording. Kind of lost track where I was, but um, I think we were changing icons. So we have voice meter veo. We got the voice meter one. So let's do those. Those are probably the hardest ones to change. What the? Okay. Uh, just change icon. We're going to browse, uh, we're going to go local disk, windows, system 32, and we're going to find drivers right here, and there should be more showing up here. Uh, Got to change this to all files, we're going to find voice meter right here. So we got voice meter, veo. And you can see how that one say aux. Uh, and there's Veo 3 right there. So we're going to choose Veo. We select it and now we get the correct icons. Red is playback. Green is recording. So we're going to choose red. Press apply. That's looking good now. Um, so we'll do the aux one next. Change icon. Browse. And we are going to find drivers. It's annoying how we have to keep pressing this. Voice meter aux, red, apply, good. Do vo veo three. Drivers, all icons or all whatever it's called. Veo three. Apply, good. Voice meter is good now. Now on to the cables. A lot easier, super straightforward. This will probably be where you have errors. You you probably won't have errors with these ones, the voice meter ones. Just doing it just in case. Um, cables are more than likely going to change after some kind of either Windows update, maybe, um, or maybe reinstalling voice meter. So we already, we already got the names correct, so we're going to change the icon, browse. This is in a different area. We're going to go to program files times 86. Or actually, no. We're going to go, sorry, program files. We're going to go to VB. You can see all the cables here. We're going to go to cable. And we're going to select the inside on the input side right here. So we're going to double click that. Press OK. Press apply. Cable's got the correct icon now. And we're just going to follow uh, that exact same way for all of them. What is this? Cable D. So, oh, uh, actually, no, cable D is a little different. I actually think cable 
uh, C and D will fix themselves after a restart. We're going to test that theory because uh, I'm going to have to restart anyways. Um, but we'll continue. A and B should be the same way. Uh, change icon, browse, um, program files, VB, and we're going to A, or no, we're on B. B, in, good, apply, okay. Now we're on A. In, good, apply, okay. Good now. Uh, recording. So uh, playback side's good now. We're going to do the recording side. We're going to fix all the names. So we'll start from the bottom. This will be voice meter veo3 output voice meter veo output We got voice meter aux, aux output. Oh. Add for you. Okay, Alexa, no. <laughs> okay. Okay. By the way, no, Alexa. Stop. Okay, this is raw editing right here. Um. Uh, apply. Cable. We got. Uh, cable output. Nice. Then we got cable D output. Same way as the other one. I mean, basically, you're just kind of doing exactly what you just did before. Cable uh, C output. Cable B output. Cable A output. And then same thing for icons. You know, actually, what you can do here is just do one of these. Copy it. Paste it. And this is gonna be the green side. Just apply. And I'm gonna test that theory out right now, actually. You should be able to just it automatically choose. Doesn't. Um I will see if this actually works. Uh, actually no. Let's just let's just make sure it's good. Let's just make sure it's in the right area, right one. Why not? Green, apply. Mm -mm -mm. Go to drivers. And we got ox green. Okay, apply. Okay, voice meter is good. Cables are so much easier. Properties change. We'll do the outside. The out picture. Apply, okay. Whoops. Uh, these will also be, oh yeah, quick side note. If you change these, uh, to 48,000 before and you reinstall, you will have to change them again. So I'll have to do that after this. Um, but yeah, those reset because you uninstall and reinstall them. Uh, cable D. Oh yeah, cable D. We're going to try that theory out with cable D and C. So we'll just leave those be. Those shouldn't, those shouldn't do anything wrong to you. I just went through and personally did it, so that's probably why they're... I, mean, that's, that, I know that's why they're changed, but I haven't restarted yet, so we'll see after that. Mm -mm. 
cable, what does this be? Right? Yeah, cable V. Out. Okay, apply. Okay. Cable A. Uh, program files, VB. Cable A, out. Good, apply. Yeah. All right, our errors should be down to a, a minimum. So from 64 to 22, not bad. We have cable C and D, which we're going to test the theory out right now. And then we need to restart after doing these because they will not allow you to do this while you're without restarting. So I'm going to restart right now. When I get back, we will see what happens. And my mic works now. Everything is not red anymore because uh, the names are back. Uh, I I had no error. Check driver installation. Okay, nothing bad detected. Looks like I'm good to go. Quick side note that I forgot. Uh, if you have one of these disabled, one of the voice reader devices, it will also give you a error saying device not listed. And as soon as you enable it, you're good to go. So that is it. That is, I mean, it's pretty straightforward. Easiest ways to probably do it is either the way I said, or you can just reinstall the cables or reinstall voice meter if you really want. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching and uh, join the Discord. If you haven't already, 100%. All right, peace out.